Welcome to our 5 on 5. We're pleased to be joined by Karen Phillips from the Maslow Project and Sue Roberts from Mobile Madness. All right, Karen, in case anyone isn't familiar with Maslow, what is it you guys do here? We provide wraparound support services to homeless kids and families here in Jackson County, kids from age 0 to 21. And the average kids we work with are 11 years old. The most wow. of them are homeless with their whole families. There was about over 2,000 we worked with last year. Yeah, and that's some of the highest levels in the state for a county, We're the correct? fourth highest, just the city of Medford is the fourth highest number of homeless kids in the state of Oregon. Wow, wow, okay, so plenty of need out there. Yes, and, and it's growing. And, and it's, okay, sorry to hear that. So, so Sue, what is your involvement with, uh, with MASA? What are you guys doing at Mobile Madness? Uh, we are collecting for them. So we are collecting um, hygiene products, food, clothing, uh, we are selling their calendars. Mm -hmm. They're fifteen dollars for the Maslow. They're really Good nice calendars. of local photographers, mm -hmm. I believe it was. Yeah, really nice calendars. Mm. So we're collecting um, through the end of the month at our store, which is at Fred Meyer North. So if you're heading into Fred Meyer to do shopping, it's easy just to swing just on right over to us and drop something center. off for them. Yeah. Perfect. Awesome. Well, thank you for doing that. You're and, welcome. And Karen, tell us about the relationships with with businesses, with the community. How important that is to helping these kids. Relationships with the community really are super important to Maslow because this is a community-wide problem. It's not something that we can address on our own. And when businesses like Mobile Madness come forward and say, how can we help, it's really inspiring. We have hundreds of businesses, organizations, civic groups, individuals throughout the county that just step in and donate and just help us get the word out about the work that we do to their customers. So important, so yes. cool. Thank you both so much for being here. We're going to take a quick break. We'll have much more in a moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to our 5 on 5. Again, we're here with Karen Phillips from the Maslow Project and Sue Roberts from Mobile Madness. So you guys are working together on this, mm -hmm. on this donation drive, uh, Sue, at Mobile Madness for the, the homeless kids and, and teens of, of, at the Maslow Project. So Karen, what is it you guys need? What are you looking for? Pretty much any basic need item you can think of, uh, clothing that's age appropriate for kids, non-perishable food, hygiene supplies, diapers, and you know donations of cash are always lovely as well. Um, but anything that you can think of that helps provide basic support to kids, bring some stability into their lives, means that they can focus instead on staying in school. Mm -hmm. Homeless kids nationally, 75% of them do not graduate from high school. And by providing these supports, we let them focus on school again. Mm -hmm. So anything that you can do would be a huge help. And I imagine with, with winter coming, it's, it's probably jackets, coats, you warm, know, Definitely warm yeah. clothes, the little hand warmers mm -hmm. that they give you. Um, food is always, always an item. And especially in the winter towards the end of the month, people run tend to run thin. So mm -hmm. anything you have. If you have any questions, certainly you can give us a call at 541-608-6868. And if you happen to be a business or an organization out there who'd like to also do what Mobile Madness is doing and find mm -hmm. a way to sponsor a drive or to support Maslow, give us a call. We'd love to give you some information about how yeah. you could help. Yeah, no, it's, it's so cool. And, and so, Sue, thank you for your involvement with this. And your donation drive continues through the end of this month, correct? It does, Okay. Yes. And what, what got you involved? Well, I was talking to Karen. I was trying to remember why we chose Maslow. Mm -hmm. um, and about three or four years ago, someone from Maslow came in with a collection box and asked us if we could take donations. And we didn't get a whole lot because we're not a destination kind of place. But um, So we decided to take our entire advertising budget for the month of December and donate that to Maslow so that they could spread the word. Wow. So, yeah. That's, so And it's yeah. really gone well. And we're really excited to have uh, been a part of this. Well, it's very impressive. Yeah. Thank it's you so much. It's been really effective at helping get the word out. And we really appreciate what they're doing. And definitely, if you're out shopping this weekend, Mobile Madness is perfectly situated, especially if you don't get on our side of town <laughs> to drop done. things off. So just saying. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> Nicely done. Ladies, thank you both so much for being here. Appreciate it. You're welcome. All right. Stay with us. We'll be right back.